Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel and welcome to a new unboxing video. Today I'm going to unbox with you my new Kurt Geiger Kensington bag for my birthday. So if you're curious, keep on watching. Hi everyone, I hope you're all doing super super well, that you're enjoying your holidays, that you're enjoying summer, the weather, the sun. Here it's finally nice uh, out, which uh, it's been a while because our summer is very late this year, so kind of is a bit sad, but at the same time, whatever, as long as it's here. And basically today I'm coming to you with a new unboxing. I haven't unboxed something since around May with my Castanier wedges that I unboxed on my channel. And today is gonna be a bag unboxing. How exciting is that, knowing I love bags and I I love Kurt Geiger. But um, just to quickly tell you, long story short, um, my birthday is on the 18th of August. It's in a few weeks. And I'm not gonna be around on my birthday. I'm normally, hopefully, on holidays away from here. So um, enjoying the sun, you know, the beach and all that good stuff. So I won't be with my parents. And this is why they decided to give me my presents a bit in advance. My dad and my mom did that. So since this particular thing I'm showing today was a present from my mom slash from to myself because we both put money in it. So before before getting into the video and the review slash unboxing, um, subscribe to my channel, it's the red button below, it's 100% free as usual and it means a lot to me as always, especially before my birthday, it means a lot if you want to subscribe, just below. But yeah, so let's get going into showing you the bag I chose and I'm also going to talk to you about Kurgeiger in general and compare it to one of the other bags I got myself last year. So let's get going. You guys probably know by now that I love Kurgeiger. I love Kurgeiger so, so much and one, it's one of my top brands because it's a premium brand, it's pretty, it's good quality, it's a good price tag, so I love so, so much Kurt Geiger. And basically last year I did an unboxing and a review of a bag I got myself in June for my birthday, like in advance as well. Uh, but this was really a gift just um, from myself to myself like nobody else. And I got myself this one, which is the Kensington bag by Kurt Geiger in gray. A lot of you guys bought it after my videos. A lot of you guys love it. This is a large, and actually I think in my videos I was saying it was the medium, but this was a total mistake. And I discovered that recently, which I feel super bad, but thankfully the link is obviously to this particular bag. So hopefully you'll like it anyways, but a lot of you guys are still buying it after watching my videos now. So I figured it's pretty cool. And this is why I also want to mention the new bag I got on this channel because I feel like you guys will love it as much as this one But this one is a bag. I've been wearing the most This is actually my most worn bag in my bag collection It used to be my Louis Vuitton Speedy 30 until this came along last year and I'm just attached to it Like I wear it in winter like fall winter spring summer all the time It's super super nice because it's comfortable to wear. It's big. It's pretty. I mean, I love the eagle head This is why I love the Kensington collection Collection by Kurt Geiger. It's because they always have the eagle, little eagle head right here and I love it so much because it's so different from other bags and it's squishy, it's leather, it's good quality and I'm obsessed with it. So I'm gonna compare my new bag to this one today because my new bag that I got is also from the Kensington Collection by Kurt Geiger so it's gonna be perfect to compare them for you guys. So let's get going and show you the new bag. The old one is gonna stay in the back while I'm gonna show you the new one which is right here. So obviously it's not really an actual unboxing because I already opened it from the box because I wanted to see if I wanted to keep it or not or if I wanted to return it. But anyways, this this is like a bag I feel like you'll like it or you won't like it. Um, my very good friend Ksenia with whom I always talk about like my new purchases, uh, she always watches my videos. You'll probably see her comments below my videos all the time. She's amazing. And basically she told me she loved the bag and I was like, okay, if she says that, it means that I need to get that bag. So I'm going to show it to you. It's one of their new collection in the Kensington collection that they have. So this is the little cutie. I mean, okay, like what else can I say except look at that. I mean, it's amazing. When I saw it on Zalondo, which is the website I always use, it's a European e-commerce that has a lot of different brands, a lot of premium ones notably, and they have Kurt Geiger, and I always buy from them because they're really, really efficient, and I really like buying from them. And I was just browsing randomly some bags because I just like to look at bags, and I was like, you know, it's soon my birthday, I kind of want to get myself a new bag. Um, you know, I sold a few from my collection, and I'd like to get a new one for summer, like a really summer vibes one. And I came across this one, and I 
fell obviously in love with it. It's pastel tie-dye. It has a little eagle head. I'm gonna put close-ups because it needs close-ups and me wearing it so you can see. The eagle head has little stones like this one basically. It also has little stones but these stones are just gray like little um, gems are gray. And these ones are like different colors like rainbow colors especially like they look exactly like the bag basically. Uh, so the eagle head obviously a typical like Kensington bag thing. Um, as you can see this is actually polyester and in the inside inside is all leather so it that's why also it's a premium brand and usually Kerr Geiger it's always like it always has some leather somewhere if not the whole bag it has it inside and this is just like tie-dye um, polyester I really like it I think it's beautiful uh, the colors are stunning it's pastel so it totally sold me on that I actually presented this similar bag in a video that I did in spring where I was talking about spring summer bags 2021 and I had gotten the Kerr Geiger one like this but it was just regular like rainbow colors like pretty um like you had blue like dark blue dark purple and i didn't keep it because it was just not really my colors but this i mean this this is like barbie meets like a unicorn that meets like something edgy because you have the little eagle head you have the little chains obviously um and yeah so i'm gonna take off all this like paper around it because i haven't yet and then i'm gonna show it to you so so stay tuned for that so i'm back and she looks so cute she looks so cute oh no i forgot this piece of paper such a cute bag so you have the usual little um chain like this it's a much much thinner chain than this one as you can see the chains are completely different this is really thick chains whilst this one is a light like a smaller one because this is actually the medium size it's not the small size it's the medium and this is the large one um so the medium size it fits quite a bit in it actually it fits my phone for example as you can see it would fit my phone it fits um, makeup it fits quite a bit of stuff obviously not as much as the large version but it still fits a lot so obviously it looks amazing you also have this little piece right here that is also tie-dye it kind of it looks like it's sparkly but it's not sparkly it's just like shiny here we go it's shiny and basically the advantage of this is that you can wear the bag like on your shoulders like this basically as simple as that I'll put little close-ups but you'll see it better after like this or you can wear crossbody or like just leave it um, on your shoulder but have it longer with a longer chain like that and then on top you have this little piece right here the little band so cute and you can do the same thing with the bigger version of the Kurt Geiger bag the only difference here is that you have two of those like leather pieces whilst here you only have one uh, leather slash polyester piece on top so that's probably because the chain is much thicker and it's a bigger bag so they have these two and obviously it's also a heavier bag um, this one is not as heavy so this is also the main difference between between both just for information this one exists also in the large size like that one um, so if you prefer large you can totally go like I will link it below anyways the two bags will be linked with the different sizes below because this one also exists actually in uh, medium so you can also shop that color in medium of course but for summer how exciting is it that I have this one I feel like it's gonna be so good when you're tanned by the beach with a beautiful flowy white dress some heels by the way if you see that the light is changing it's just because the weather is obviously obviously again back to ugly weather like literally I show a beautiful bag and the weather is back like going crazy but anyway so yeah so this is the bag and I'm gonna show you the back as you can see the tie-dye is slightly different you have a bit more pink and blue you have the Kerr Geiger sign right here inside as I said it's all leather and you have quite a bit of space it's there's actually a dust bag that comes with it there's always dust bags it's so nicely done here you only have one main pocket and then you have like a tiny one in the back just you can put like cards or something or lipstick but overall it's just one kind of pocket in a way then in this one you will have the options of two pockets like there's two sections here we go. it's not a pocket it's a section here you have two sections while the medium one only has one section and a little pocket in the back but to be honest since it is a medium one I don't really mind it I personally wouldn't go for the large one for myself just because I think it's a bit too statement to go for a large one so I love the medium because I really envision myself wearing this even in the evening evening or during the day when it's warm and yeah I mean the close-ups are gonna show you much better what the bag looks like with the little eagle head and the little gems and also how it looks on me um, I'm 5'2 so you can imagine a little bit what it looks like I think it's the perfect size but to be honest even the large one is a perfect size for a short person or a petite person even uh, I think they look really good but um, yeah this is part of their new collection that is all about rainbows so go check out their website that I will also link below they have a bunch of rainbowy bags so it's really pretty 
see. The closures are magnetic, um, exactly like these ones. That's exactly the same thing. And I think all Kerr Geiger bags are going to be pretty similar in that sense. Well, yeah, this one retails actually for the prices. That's the little taboo subject, as I like to say on my channel. This one retails for 250 Swiss francs, which obviously depends where you buy it. Sometimes the conversion is different. Sometimes the price is different. That really it depends a lot on that. This one is, was also 250 Swiss francs, um, which is funny because they're both the same price, but this one is smaller um, and there's less leather on that one. So I guess maybe because it's a new collection or perhaps the tie dye effect is a bit more complicated that I'm not so sure, but uh, the price is exactly the same. Um, so yeah, so this one was 250, which is obviously a premium price tag for a really good quality. I think it's totally worth it. And I'm just so looking forward to wearing it. You'll see it in a lot of pictures, I hope, and probably in some videos in the future. I feel like I want to call it like sweetie or something like that, because I feel like it matches perfectly well with her personality and her style and her look like she looks so cute seriously so cute this is my new addition to my little uh, bag collection which I'm probably gonna film a bag collection soon because it's been a year and a half that I haven't and my bag collection has changed I've sold up many bags and I've also bought new bags so yeah but I'll wait for the fall winter time to do that because I feel like there's a lot of other things are coming up soon related to my channel and collaborations and stuff so there will be probably a better bag collection in fall or winter this year but yeah that for that stay tuned and yeah so that's pretty much it for today's unboxing i'm so so excited for my birthday um even though i already bought uh, you know my own gift and i already opened it and opened many of other gifts i'm still super excited um obviously as i said if you're not subscribed yet do subscribe the red button below and if you enjoyed this video do let me know in the comments as well and yeah so that's pretty much it for my unboxing today and as i always say i will see you next week in my next video bye everyone